Welcome back to the course in Robotic Process Automation. I trust that by the time you're watching this video, that you have created several automation. In this video, I will take you again through the interface briefly in preparation for the next example, which is all about how to manage files that you receive from email. Great. We are back at the previous flow that we just tested. Now click on my flows on the left navigation. You'll notice that your newly created automation is now there, hopefully together with many others that you've created. When you move the mouse over any of the flows, an edit, share, and menu icons show. Click on the flow menu icon. You'll notice that you have a lot of actions that you can perform on the flow. The one in particular is the save as option. This option allows you to duplicate your automation. It is a useful action when you want to use the same flow with just minor tweaks perhaps on the triggers and or actions. For example, the automation that we just created can be tweaked to create tasks from other colleagues other than your manager. Pretty useful hey! You can also turn on and off your flows or delete them. Sharing of flows is only available on the paid version of Power Automate. But, a caution on it is that when you share a flow that you use, never make somebody else a co-owner, rather send a copy of it to that person. That's it on the interface for now. See you on the next video about how to manage files that comes as email attachments.